Verb Time Sequence Error The purpose of verb tenses is to help us specify the time of an occurrence. In broad sense, the past tense is used to talk of events that are over. The present talks of something that is happening at the time of the conversation and future talks of something that is likely to happen after the conversation. The sense of the sentence and the context should tell you which tense you should use. In English, it is essential to make sure that the verb tense and the time sequence it denotes are in the proper form. Let's see an example. She came tomorrow. What is wrong with this sentence? The action is mentioned in the past tense. Hence, the time sequence should also be in the past. How can I correct this sentence? Exactly. She came yesterday or any other point of time in the past or she will come tomorrow. Now the verb tense and the time sequence are in proper form. Let us look at another sentence. Unless you work hard, you could not be able to get the first rank. What went wrong here? If any sentence starts with unless or if, it is hypothetical and hence the time sequence should point to the future. Hence, the correct sentence is, unless you work hard, you will not be able to get the first rank. Now it's time for you to correct a sentence. After he had finished his performance, he would go to the party. Is the given sentence correct? How can you correct it? Look at the first half of the sentence. After he had finished his performance, what time does this denote? The past. Had finished implies that the action was over long time back. It is understood that after he had finished his performance, he went to the party. So both the events should be in the past. The correct sentence is, After he had finished his performance, he went to the party. Is the topic clear now?